It simply was just a normal night at Club Q. And then out of nowhere, in one hate-filled act lasting less than one minute, five beautiful people lost their lives, 17 people injured, and a community changed forever. This building is a reminder of our greatest nights spent together, but also our most horrific night together. More than all these reminders, being here today is a reminder that five vibrant, passionate, creative, proud, and unapologetic people are no longer with us. Daniel Aston, Derek Rump, Ashley Powell, Kelly Loving, and Raymond Green Vance. We honor them today and every day. We remember them today and every day. We ache today because they should be here. We anger because this never should have happened. And we protest for change in a country that so desperately needs it. It's important to remember that they were not what you would typically think of as a hero. They didn't fight in a war or go do some big thing. They were people. <laughs> that was all they did and they died and now they aren't here and now their faces are on posters and we're setting candles up simply because what? Because they used a different name, different pronouns. It's important that we understand that they were still people and that they share a message and a story, but they were still people. And I think it's important for the families, I think it's important for them and the memory of them to understand that and to talk about that. We keep doing what we're doing. We keep strong in one another. We support each other. We find new places that are safe. We up protection. We show the older, the younger, the ones our same age that we are still here. We are bigger, brighter, bolder, stronger than ever.